Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Just Fred, where I am playing Final Fantasy IV. Last episode, we did a majority of this area. This episode, I'm actually going to use a cottage right now. Because I need more MP. <laughs> this place is uh, difficult. Well, I just get, yeah, I just take a bullet of damage. <laughs> Every goddamn battle. This is looking a lot better. Let's go and save now. So I also finally noticed the difference between a tent and a cottage. A cottage heals more MP than a tent does. Ambushed by Medusa! <laughs> and a stone goal. Ray. Stone, yep. How about you punch that big thing in the face? Ray again. I Put to sleep, perfect. That's what I wanted. Let's see, magic and super blizzard, and hope that it does some damage. It does some damage, yes. Uh, anybody we need healing? I guess Rosa herself. A th okay. A thousand four hundred and forty damage. That's uh, that's pretty freaking good. Rosa learned shell magic. Rosa, I haven't even looked at any of these things. So it's a passing of time. Open screen map. Causes paralysis. Scan. Silence. Uh, creates illusion of oneself to confuse the enemy. Shell increases magic damage. I'm sorry. It decreases. <laughs> Reduces. And physical damage. Ah, okay. Okay, good. I need to remember this stuff. Like I said, I rarely ever use freaking buffs. <laughs> Even though they are really freaking good. I'm running. I don't care. Actually, I probably should have fought that one. That one was pretty easy to fight. <laughs> the eighth floor. <laughs> Screw it. I'm punching you to death. All you alert more. Hopefully not cameras. It's a stone golden. That's actually good because they give a decent amount of XP. Yay for the beam attack. Fuck me. Um, let's use black magic. One damage. Woohoo. Alright. How about you kill an eye? Thank you. Okay. Let's go and aim. Oh my god. That's a lot of freaking damage. And Kane with the 480, and then 2120. Well then. <laughs> okay. That was pretty crazy. Alright, it is time to heal Rydia again. <laughs> well, usually it's freaking. Uh, usually it's other people that need healing. Okay. Uh, have a safe trip, Master River Kante. Not to worry. Uh, I'm sorry. Not, <laughs> I don't need to do the wrong thing. Not to worry. Eblin has been decimated along with its ninjas. Take care of things until I return. Um, hello? Oh, God. Another one of these weirdos. Hey, 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 Golbez and Rikambe are gone. I'm in charge now. What's with him? Shh. Who's there? <laughs> Cecil, how did you get up here? Uh, blah, blah, caught, caught you at a bad time, eh? With your Rikambe gone, what are you going to do? How dare you disrespect me, fools! I may not be an elemental lord, but I, Dr. Luge, am, bra am the brains of Golbez's operation. On my honor, I will protect this tower. That's a laugh. I've heard enough out of you. My great creation will shut you up soon enough. His great creation, Barnabas? Barnabas. <laughs> um, let's go and use... I want to do Titan, does it? Yeah. And remove. And Shiva? Okay. Let's go and use Chocobo. Chocobo kick! It should do a decent amount of damage. Yeah, that's a decent amount of damage. What the hell? 
is this? <laughs> I think this is probably the guy that created the dolls. Mind of us, attack! <laughs> Summon another chocobo to kick him in the face. Oh boy. <laughs> Yo, you big oaf! Over there, beat him, beat him up! <laughs> Show no mercy! Alright, let's go and aim. I guess this is the battle. <laughs> now I'm going as a doctor, so Barnabas is probably not gonna know what to do now. Uh oil, oil! Self destruct! <laughs> oh boy, that's gonna die. Ooh. Yeah, I'm sorry, Yang. <clears throat> How dare you face my true evil! <clears throat> Dr. Dugate, no more games! I guess there's no more games? Uh, Shiva. Sleeping gas, fuck. Alright, let me go and uh, heal up Yang. Oh, I'm sorry, revive Yang. Transform! Oh my god! <laughs> okay then. Diamond Dust. I just wanted to see what this do would do actually. It does a decent amount of damage. White magic. Cura on him. Poison gas. Shit. <laughs> Beam? Okay, so this guy likes to use a lot of um, status ailments, it would seem. Esuna! I can only use it on one person. Let's go and use it on Rosa. Summon? Let's summon Ifrit. Another laser incoming. Okay, that was a death. Freaking sleeping gas. Hellfire! Can you stop? Please. Can you please stop being an asshole? Okay, that was a death. Flamethrower? Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that doesn't do damage, damage. Okay. Summon. Let's summon Titan. White magic. Uh, do you have anything stronger than Cura? I don't think you do. Let's just go and heal everyone here. I'm going to use Esuna um, I guess, Yang. Gaia's Wrath! Ooh, damn. Sleeping gas again, Panacea. Wait, what? Did he just heal me? To then put me back to sleep? Oh, that's a dirty move. He healed me? Ah, oh, crap. I... Whoa, that's a nice amount of damage. Mm. He's putting everybody to sleep again. And then using beam. Okay, that's not too much damage. Alright. Laser again. Uh, Kane took a lot of damage from that one last time. Okay. Uh, let's go and use SNR again. And on Cecil. Alright, how about you do another jump attack? White magic, Asuna, um, Yang. And punch him in the face! Uh, Kira. Oh my god, can you please stop putting. Actually, I think I think it probably only counters physical attacks then. Panacea, once again. Hey! <laughs> Kane, where are you? <laughs> I leveled up! There you go. You're too late. The Tower of Babel connects the underworld, uh, the underworld and the overworld, and Rubicante has already taken all the crystals to the surface. The dwarves will be annihilated with my cannons. Victory is mine! <laughs> and he just blows up, yep. 
The dwarves are in danger. We've got to stop the cannons. What are we waiting for? Let's go. Does this take me over to the thing? It seems some kind of warp system. It looks like it's no use to us. <laughs> Come on, Cecil! <laughs> um... How about we uh, do some healing? I know which door I need to open up. I'm just very intrigued to see if there's anything else over here. I don't really think so, but there is a chest over there though. I'm just running, mate. <laughs> I don't care about the freaking cameras anymore. Actually, I never cared about them. They suck. They suck a lot of dick. Chimeras, run! <laughs> Alright, running all the way down the tower again. Actually, it's not that far. And Chimeras. <laughs> chimeras? No, Black Blizzards, they're even worse. <laughs> Actually, no, the Chimeras are probably worse, but the Black Blizzards are just annoying. Oh no, 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 no. All of these enemies just suck, so I'm just gonna run away from them. Fuck them. Fuck the door. The door is locked. Use... Uh, Dr. Bagay's key. The door's been locked. Good. Ah, killing dwarves is fun! You cowards! You, how did you get in here? Kill them! Goblin captains. <laughs> well then. There we go. Ah, let's the, destroy the, the controls! Nothing can stop the cannons now! Damn it! Yang! What are you doing? Leave this to me. You, uh, go get out of here. No! It's going to explode. Go now! Yang! Sister, everyone, I thank you. Open the door! Yang! Please don't do this. Tell my wife I will always be with her. Yang! Farewell. Yang! The door is broken. Well, there goes my camera puncher. <sighs> okay, then. Game. <laughs> Thank you for murdering off a character that I actually liked. Woohoo. Can you face? <laughs> Can I teleport out of here? <laughs> no! <laughs> Fucking hell. What's the point of that dumb spell anyway? Never works. Run! I'm just running from all these encounters. I don't give a single crap anymore. Or at least not by... I don't give a crap by the enemies in here in any case. Um, I guess I'm supposed to leave the tower now, right? Ah, uh, no! Fuck! Run, 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 run. Get the hell out. Oh, come on, mate. Ah, uh, fuck off. Stop following me. Okay, this is just a treasure thing. Come on. Puppeteers and evil dolls? Crap! <laughs> right, this is the third floor again. And this is the second floor. Wait, puppeteers and evil dolls. Um. Wait. I haven't seen the evil dolls before. There they are. 
Also, I haven't taken a look at the uh, Medusa. Let's see. Uh, they drop decoys. Of course, they'll do. And the Medusas can drop. They can drop Medusa arrows and the Stone Blade. Just like the lizard things can do. Cool, I guess. Uh, Alright. Fucking leave me alone! Yes, 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 yes. You never cease to amuse me. Galvis! When the cat is away, the mice will play. The game ends now. doesn't get closer than that. Sid. Where's Yang? Sob, sob. We've lost another, we've lost another good man. And who is she? Rydia, she's the summoner from Mist. Damn, they're still on me. Can we lose them? I don't know, they are, they've definitely upgraded the Red Wings. They're catching up. Come on, baby, you can do it. I was using the Yang voice, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Whoops. The engine's not gonna last. Cecil, take over. Sid, where are you going? Once she flies out of here to the surface, I'm gonna stick. I'm gonna seal the entrance with its bomb. Wait. Oh yeah. Head on back to Baron afterwards and talk to my men. Sid, Cecil, take care. They take good care of Rosa. Treat her well. No, th no. There has to be another way. Sid, please don't. Hey, that's Uncle Sid to you. Remember, head for Baron immediately. <laughs> what the hell is it with all of this suicide? Jesus. Now this is what I call out going out with a bang. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, my eyes. <laughs> Sid, why? Uh, why? Everyone chooses death too quickly. Let's head to Baron. Let us do that. Let us. Hmm. Call it let us. Um, I was. I need to go upwards, I think. And then to the west. That's missed, so that means the Baron is down here. Yep. Alright, let's go and save the game. Because god damn it. <laughs> let's go and rest again. And yeah. <laughs> okay. It really sucks actually because Yang and Cecil. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yang and Sid were both really good characters. Sid was really good. Actually, mm, Yang was better, I think. I don't know, man. Well, the thing is, Rose is really good, Kane is decently good, and Rydia is also really good as a summoner, and Cecil is always good, so... Yeah. There's only one more party member left, actually, and that's Edward. If he's even alive. Or, if he's even, if he's even going to live to the end of the game. Uh, if he's even alive. <laughs> uh. Wait. Ready? Oh, no. Wait. What? Um, I need to go and talk to his men. I don't know where his men are. Hmm. 
I have to talk to his men, but I don't know where they are. Uh, maybe they're down here. I don't think so, but... Oh, no, wait, this is that area. Okay. Wait, are these his men? I think they are. I know, still the boss orders us to attach this hook to the Enterprise. It won't take long. Ah, there you go. It's done, now we can hoist and carry the hovercraft. Just fly the Enterprise right above the hovercraft and press the A button to load and unload the vehicle. With both vehicles we can go pretty much everywhere now, even the cave of uh, Avalon by the Tower of Babel. There's something I must tell you about, it's about Sid. He's impossible, yes we know. With all that crazy energy I can't imagine he'll ever check out. Please babysit him a little while longer. Okay, cool, so now we have the airship with the hook. I'm gonna go and check something out for a sec. Dip, 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 dip. Dra, bra, bra. Yep. This door. Okay, yeah. I just want to be sure that I got that thing. Okay. Let's go back to the map, and let's go and save the game. And then let's see where we can go with them, our new... Our new little upgrade. Okay, so let's go and retrieve the hovercraft, and then see what we can do. The hovercraft should be around here somewhere. And hovercraft over there, yep. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh man, this is really cool. Um, now, where did I need this thing? They said like the cave of Babel or whatever. There's one area where I can put this thing down. But aside from that, where else can I put this thing down? This is probably the cave of Babel, right? Okay, I'm going to put you down there and land over here. Okay, take the hovercraft. Uh, yes, okay. Now let's save the game before I enter this cave, because I have no idea what might be in this freaking cave. The Adamant Grotto. Hello. Beat it, I'll, t I'll talk to you only when you bring me back a tail. Nothing happened. <laughs> Not found an unusual ore here, but he tried to find unusual animal tails. He likes collecting them. Okay. Um, alright then. I guess I can't do anything over here until I get a freaking tail. Okay. Let's grab the freaking hovercraft and continue looking around. Because I think I only have one place that I have to go to with, with the hovercraft. I just don't know where. Where or oh, where art thou? Oh wait, it's actually near the area of the Tower of Babel. Uh, Babel? <laughs> Babel, no. Babel, or Babel, or Babel, or <laughs> something like it in any case. Um, there's this thing, there's Mithril, I think it's called. Is that Mithril? I don't know. Um, the thing I do know is that, that that is a Tower of Bubble and that this is the area that I'm supposed to go to. Wait me, little hovercraft. Yep. Alright, let me go and uh, dump you over here. And land next to you. Alright, 
Let's go and check it out. I find the idea of hovercraft really freaking cool in Final Fantasy. <laughs> okay, let's go into this cave. The Eblin Cave, basement one, or basement floor one. That means that this is gonna be a pretty hefty dungeon, isn't it? With new and surprisingly tough enemies. <laughs> oh yeah. Skulgers, 42 damage, that's decent. 177 damage, that's a lot more. 232 damage, that is a little bit too much. You should be able to use fire. Which should normally work on skeletons. Nice, 522 damage. Let's go and use cure. That should also do some damage. 48. <laughs> That's not enough. Well, they have one less part member to worry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um. Um, it seems like the sphere isn't that good against undead. Not sure, but I have a tiny feeling that I shouldn't use this this sphere when fighting undead. That's pretty, <laughs> that's just pretty dumb. Okay, let's go and uh, hit up game. Beep, 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 right. Now I can use freaking teleport, my god, it makes no freaking sense. It just don't make any sense to me. Okay. Um, Kane, I would require you to switch over to the Icelands for the time being. <laughs> Because the Bloodlands will kill you, because skeletons will take your life with it. Or undead in general. Who goes there? Oh, humans. Wait, excuse me? An inn? Excuse me? Do you sell ethers? <laughs> no. Nobody sells freaking ethers. What the hell is this cave? I'm gonna go and pour in some soda, because I need to drink some. Thing. Something. No, 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 no. Huh. <laughs> this is quite an interesting episode, I gotta say. I'm also eventually, mm, I don't know when, but eventually I'm also gonna go back and see about getting, or maybe see about getting um, all the summons for Rydia. Because I would be very interested in getting it. We are the proud people of Evelyn. We are castle destroyed. This is all that uh, that is left for our kingdom. Oh my god. Armor and weapon shop. Ice armor, black robe. Let's buy the black robe. Um, ice armor. Hmm. Inventory is full. Uh, equipment. The black robe. Wait, do I have anything new? Power ammo, that's right. The killer bow is better than the other bow, yep. Some arrows. Switch of surplus. Um, yes please. Fire shield is the same, but <laughs> the bloodlands will kill him in this freaking cave. Um, Ice Brand is the strongest for the time being, in any case. Okay, let's go and see about selling some stuff that I don't need. Well, yeah, I guess I'll just sell the claws. Mithril Sword. The Wind Spear, don't care about that. Mithril Hammer. Mm, I might want to hold on to this thing. The great bow can bugger off. 
and mithril shields, iron helms, knight armor, wizard hat, again bogies, silver armlets, better cap, the power armlet, the flame sword, the hell claw. The mithril staff is still quite useful, so I will be holding on to that one. Let's go and sort out the inventory. And let's go and buy ourselves at least one piece of this uh, ice armor and take a look at how actually good it is. It is pretty freaking good. <laughs> I do say. Um, what do you sell from weapons before I waste my money? <laughs> huh, said that sometimes drives enemies berserk. Ice Brand, Ice Lance, a Kunai, Boomerang, Killer Bow, Poison Arrows. Hmm. Let's go and buy the Power Staff. Instead of the Arrows, you can use the Power Staff for the timing. Okay, remove. And let's get the Power Staff going. Okay, um, you know what? I have enough money for another Ice Armor piece. There you go. I've done it. <laughs> There's no going back in now. Um, but that's still a pretty decent upgrade. And I can just sell the Mithril Armor. Where is it? Uh, the Mithril Armor. Holy crap, that's a lot of money that I get from that. Cool. Alright. This is the passageway to the Tower of Babel, where Rubicante resides. The prince went to scout ahead, but has yet to return. Survivors are hiding inside. We only have a little food left. I wonder how long we'll be able to survive. A potion. Where did that monster come from? How did they defeat our ninjutsus? <laughs> ninjutsu is so easy. I can't believe what happened to the king and queen. I'm a senior minister of Avalon, the prince's arch, but a good man. He went to the Tower of Babel to avenge his parents. Can you stop moving? <laughs> the prince said he'd take care of all the monsters. Once he saves uh, them all, uh, we can finally go back to the castle. I'm gonna protect my mom so no one can hurt her. I'm gonna have a little brother and s or sister soon. He's so brave. Perhaps Ablon's ninjutsu. N ninjutsu? Ninjutsu? Yeah. Will emblend us. Hang in there. Name you. Well, hello there. <laughs> uh, hope his majesty is alright. What am I saying? Of course he is. Potion. Oh, Okay, nothing down here. No. Alright, now um, I shall be exploring the rest of this cave, if you don't mind me. Okay. Alright, let's go. Uh, nothing over here. A vampire fang. What is a vampire fang? Wait, nah. Alright. Um, swords. Yep, that's an item. Okay. Just want to see if it's equipment or item. <laughs> and another freaking soldier. This time I came prepared. <laughs> this time I don't use my lands that will give you life and take away my life. <laughs> Yay for constantly hitting my character or one character. I'm sorry. Fire, burn, skeletons burn. Holy crap, that's a one shot. My god, Kane, you're slow. <laughs> you are ridiculously slow. Good. Anything up here? Yes. Hey, this is where the steel golem is. Let's go and use Ifrit. Uh, white magic. Let's go and cure everything. Right, if it's Hellfire! Firefly! That did. <laughs> 3500 damage. Oof. Uh, 
Hello, that's death. Wow. Nicely done. Okay. Alright. Time to go and heal. <laughs> yes, welcome to the wondrous world of Final Fantasy, where you do nothing but go into inventory and heal. After every freaking battle. And get attacked again by bloody bats! Vampire. Uh, that's almost no freaking damage. That's also not that amazing. Wow. So, huh, this is really weird. Or is it? Hmm, I'll have to take a look, because the steel golem... Huh. Paralyzed! <laughs> Get hit by the cane and go berserk! Okay, that should be good. Alright. Let's go and take a look. At the enemies because the steel golem where the hell is the vampire dude because the steel golem is all the way down here we have a security eye which we ran into uh security eye can drop a security eye <laughs> okay um hmm we ran into the fiery hounds, didn't we? Yeah. They can drop fire arrows, bomb fragments, bomb arm, and red fangs. Then we also ran into a mad ogre before. They can drop back a swine, twist headband, power armlet, or giant's gloves. Um, now we also ran into vampire bats. Which I don't really see on the list. My god. <laughs> Everything is starting to get very confused. Now, very confused? Yeah, sure. A health ladder. What the hell is all this stuff? In the underworld. Okay, so there's a lot of enemies that I didn't see in the underworld. Chrysalis or whatever is also underground. Um, the Glooming. Another underworld one. Hmm. E they can drop ethers, stardust, and lunar curtains, and Artemis as well. Those are. Those seem like pretty crazy things. A Gorgon. A Gorgon Zola can drop Medusa arrows and a Gorgon blade. Huh. Well, then I probably should have maybe explored more in there. Uh, and then we have eggs that can, like a mystery egg that can drop nothing. <laughs> An iron back, which is another one of armor buildings. Can drop a mithril shield, mithril hammer, high potion, X potion. Uh, what the hell are all, all of these things? Because I don't... Oh, these things, yeah, they're these. These things are called what? Is it their name? Curls or something. They can drop cat claws. We ran into those before, I think, when we opened one of those chests. Uh, a balloon. That is another version of a bomb. In the Tower of Babel, lunar surface. Uh, bomb fragments, an arctic winds, a bomb core, and it can also drop the bomb summon. A sorcerer. Huh, this is another one of those guys. The Tower of Babel. Huh. Healing staff, rune armlet, rune staff. It's the same as the other guys. A ghost knight. They can drop tents and cottages. Wait, where can they be found? They can be found in the Tower of Babel also. These are all enemies from the Tower of Babel, which is really weird. Lamia Magic York. You can drop from my. Uh, you can steal from a Lamia harp from them. Uh, a normal Lamia. With a very weird texture. <laughs> okay. Uh, they can drop Lamy Harp, Ruby Ring, uh, Light Curtain, and Angel Arrows. This doesn't seem to be in the right place. <laughs> a Grudger. Lightning Arrow, Heavenly Wrath, Zeus's Wrath, and Blue Fangs. Okay. And then we have the Fiery Hounds, the Security Eyes. Uh, stone golems. I think I just ran into one of those, right? I think I did. High potion, Medusa arrows, and X potions. And that is it, I think. I can't really find the vampire dudes.
Okay. Alright. Enough, uh, enough googling. A shuriken. And a remedy. Or a shuriken. I don't think anybody says shuriken, does it? I don't know. Yay, another soldier party. Killed him! Let's go and use my bee magic. My bee magic! Pretty solid 700 damage. Alright, come on. Thundora, of course. You missed. Ha! Or you failed. One or two. La 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 la. Let's see, can I go down here? No. Alright. It's no problem. Hey, would you look at that? More skeletons. Alright, let's just fire. Crazy. Freaking Rosa. Kiraga and Mini. Not sure how useful Mini will be, but Kiraga is pretty freaking useful. Alright. Let's go and uh, rest at the end, I guess. There you go. And I will. You know what? I think I will end up the episode. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode just a bit where I play Final Fantasy IV. And next episode, we're gonna continue and see where... whatever the hell we're... I don't know. Just gonna do some stuff, I guess. Alright, goodbye.